Now to our big story at nine, cops behaving badly. The Sheboygan Police Department disciplining 10 of its officers. And the punishment comes after reports of sexual harassment of female officers on the force. Our Amelia Jones dug into the documents today. She joins us live here in the studio with what started the complaints. Ben, Mary, here's just part of the more than 170 page investigation and in it is troubling details of how inappropriate photos of female officers were passed around. One attorney I spoke to today says things can quickly rise to harassment levels. It's um, disappointing to hear about wrongful conduct within a community and an organization that's created to keep people safe. 10 Sheboygan police officers were disciplined for sexual misconduct. A month's long internal investigation found four male officers had sexually harassed female colleagues. Documents obtained by Fox 6 detail how one victim found out a partially nude photo of her was getting passed around without her consent. The report says another victim sent nude photos to a former Sheboygan police officer but the photos were also getting passed around. Well, any sort of conduct or comments or behavior that is of a sexual nature could rise to the level of sexual harassment um, if it's taking place among employees in the workplace. Danielle Schroeder is not involved in this case, but has represented others in sexual harassment. Schroeder says many don't report the harassment because they're afraid of retaliation especially when the workplace is predominantly one gender. They may feel that they have a target on their back. According to a national survey on sexual harassment of law enforcement, 71% of female officers reported experiencing harassment or assault on the job, compared to 41% of male officers. People we spoke to in Sheboygan are concerned. If the cops doing that, how are we going to feel safe? The consequences for the officers varied from a 10 day unpaid suspension to putting a personal phone in a locker during work hours and attending a harassment training. We reached out to the Sheboygan police chief for comment. We did not hear back yet. Mary. All right, Amelia Jones. Thank you.